Welcome back again. Whew. So I'm gonna try to do the left, then right. With the six O E T two. Seven and a five is kinda of hard to, to negotiate space through that narrow gladic opening. So let's see what can happen now. Okay. Looking. Accords. In. Quarter turn left. No, this is blind. I'm like trying to do what a bronchoscopy would be doing. Make this possible. It's getting very narrow here. Okay. There's a chance inflating the cuff here is going to inhibit me from passing the tube. So there's a chance. If that's the case, I'm going to have to deflate that left sided ET tube. <coughs> left more than right. <coughs> and the issue is will I be allowed passage into the right? Okay. Now, the orifice. Alright, there's nudge just to keep a little bit to the left. And I hope that this bougie. Right next to it. I sneak down the middle. And hope. Quarter turn. I just did a quarter turn. I think it sneaked through. I think it did. These are crazy ass MacGyver maneuvers, okay? MacGyver maneuvers. Snuck a 6 0 next to another 6 0. I'm gonna end. Is inflating the right a little bit, but I think the passage was impeded. Right. I do think passing the tube through this can canal. Something crazy and see if I can actually deflate this to hope it doesn't dislodge. I'm gonna go a little deeper so that this too can actually go deeper as well. It's such a tight fit. Oh my god. These are crazy ass MacGyver rules. Even then, don't let him pass. Maybe in the real world, it's easier, but not letting me, not letting me pass. So I isolate the left, go back to inflating that. Go for the best. With this tube, can't sneak deeper, but it's not trying to go deeper. It's probably being impeded by the plastic. Like a right. Mm -hmm. 
so. There's some, some line, but hopefully this is the best you've done. Not the best I think I could have done, but that's how it worked out. This is hard. Regardless of what you're doing, this guy can die while you're doing it. Alright? This is hard. Okay, so maybe better off the trachea. Or opening it slightly wider than negotiating the bougie through a lot of opening. Close your to the carina, maybe it's easier to direct the direction of your bougie. I may need to use 5.5 .5 or 5.0 ET2, but then I would have to use a pediatric uh, bougie. Okay. Please come back for another episode of School Railway. Bye bye.